Hairstyles today is style guide. I think nine, uh, but if it's wrong, I apologize. But um, I'm kind of losing count. Um, this is the style we're going to create today. Do you like? Um, and I did it earlier today, and um, you can see I pulled it up and then I kind of plaited over. I don't remember what I did, but I'm going to try my best to recreate it. I actually don't remember exactly what I did, but maybe as I take it down, you know, the usual format, I take it down and I'll try to remember um, how I did it. This is the fringe bit coming down. Um, so you need quite a lot of hair um, in the front bit um, to help you create this style. And it's obviously slanted to my right. Um, so if you want it to your left then do that um, and um, I'm taking the back out now and um, it's obviously in a little band okay okay so um, as usual um, the uh, this is a challenge for me as well actually I'm beginning to realize but um, the idea is to create a style um, as quickly as you can with as little effort as possible hence the what's it called the messy kind of look um styles but kind of messy look is what we're going for i had a band okay so um you need um a hairband and some pins and it all depends on the length of your hair um if your hair length is um quite um sh it's kind of short you know struggling to don't pull it into it don't force it just pin it um, and as, as usual this style is for let me show you my hair down and this style is for everyone um whatever hair type you have really if you can create this style then it's for you i happen to be wearing sister locks and so obviously when i style i style with my sister locks but it's for anyone permed extension wearers loose afro hair wearers white hair anyone really who has hair and wants to style it really quickly you can use these tips you're more than welcome on my channel um, to help you style your hair. Um, okay, so pull the hair up. That's what you're going to do. Pull the hair up and um, pull it up into a kind, like just make sure you know how much hair you want out. Okay, so I feel like, um, I always close my eyes when I do this so I know I can kind of feel my way. Okay, I don't want to pull this side of my hair okay so normally you would choose to pull that back but i think i want it out for now um, and then i might tuck it in later on gently so i've kind of pulled it out but put it between my last two fingers okay because i don't want to pull okay so i'm putting it down again i'm taking my band collecting as much of the hair as, as i can and the, the loose locks i shall tuck them in or use a um use a pin now i am trying to get all the hair out um hence the reason why i'm kind of combing my fingers and then i'm banding it okay there banding it um i'm gonna try to reband it again um but if i can't get it all the way through to the other side then i'll improvise because it is never ever that simple when you try and recreate a style so i might improvise now i'm realizing that the band is quite small for my head so hence why i'm struggling um okay so i've pushed it through as best as i can um but you need to free up the hair because you're going to braid it so let's try and free up the hair, Melissa. Um, okay. Freeing up the hair. Okay. As you're doing this, as I'm doing this, I'm still thinking about my follicles. Um, I'm pulling through, but I'm also making sure that when it comes in a bun, it's not going to permanently kind of be pulling on the follicles. Can you see what I'm doing? Okay. Now, do you remember I said 
um, at the beginning that this is kind of like a messy look. Okay, this is going to be a messy look because um, not every lock is going to go through this band, I think. Um, but that's as best as I can do it. Now, what would happen is the bits that are loose, I will just tuck in. You will just find your way. Okay. So you, you pull it in because this gives you the height um, and it's very important. Now, um, and then can you see what I'm doing? I'm doing an inverted, loosely doing an inverted. That's what you're going to do. Um, and just you're, all you're doing is bringing the hair together um, loosely. Um, if it sticks out a bit, that's all right, because remember, we're going for the messy look. I'm styled, but um, if you've got bits sticking out, that, that that's all right um, as well. Um, you're doing it loose because you, you've obviously pulled on the hair and you, you don't want to um, pull like any more harder on your follicles, basically. So I am just trying to braid it to the end. Now, if you're struggling to braid it to the end, then what you would do is just use a little hairband that matches the your hair complexion basically um, and there, there it is I've done that now if you don't want it all to be sticking out um, just use a pin so I'm kind of um, trying to pin some of it down but I realize that some of it would stick up and that's fine because that's probably that's I'm going to improvise that's part of the look okay so um, and then you start braiding the front and I'm braiding from this end because I want it to uh, move towards my right side. So can you see what I'm doing? Loosely, just loosely braiding in the hair. And that's uh, that's the, that's kind of your fringe, my fringe. Okay. Can you see what I'm doing? Okay. So, you've got two bits. The top bit, which is, should be quite up, like, up. With some bits sticking out, because it just depends on how quickly you want this to achieve this look. And then you've got that. And then, basically, you tuck. And that's it. And then I love to accessorize, so there's my flower. The idea is always that you have um, a short time to style your hair you've got to go out voila now um you could give it even more of a secure lift if you feel like okay i want it to have a bit more of the lift so you could use what i'm using is wool left over from a style that i had um, for the natural noir event which was fantastic um and just tuck it in to give it more height more definition if that's what you're looking for and then again this you improvise you can tuck it in or push it into itself i i, I want to tuck it into the and then I, I want it to be a bit secure so i am just pinning it down can you see so you can do it either way you can just band it and braid it through you could have a, anything really that you like a little uh cloth that you fabric that you like that matches your outfit like if i wanted to i would have used the head tie with this the little strip and use it and that's it under 10 minutes styling for everyone um i hope you like it i'll give you a 12 um and that's it really thank you very much everyone i hope you're able to achieve this and um stay connected let me know if you were able to achieve this style, if you like. Um, thank you for the subscriptions and the connections and your feedback has been positive. Um, let's see whether this style works for you. Thank you everyone for watching this video. Uh, more styles obviously to come and more conversations, more sharing. Take care. Bye everyone. Ah, well, Mono Safel SK, original, Africa Ringer.
Balancez, balancez, bougez, bougez, balancez, balancez.